By the end of this course, you will be able to draft a basic A-line skirt with an invisible zipper using custom measurement and clothes 3D. In addition, I will share with you these easy and effective ways to draft this pattern. Then we will sew and fit the skirt onto the avatar. But that's not all. I will also share with you some tips and tricks to achieve the most realistic look for this skirt. Finally, I will demonstrate how to capture that amazing skirt pattern so you can share it on social media as well as your potential customer. Are you ready? Let's cut to it. I'm going to to create the basic A-line skirt. First, I want to show you guidelines that I have listed in the video description. So over here, I have step-by-step -step on how to create a basic A-line skirt. If you want to zoom into this image, simply click on that image right there and then you have this full large image. Then if you want to get back to the page, simply click on this X right here to close and now you get back to the page. And if you keep scrolling down, you will see more step-by-step -step guide on how to create this A-line skirt. Next, let's get back to clothes. First step, we want to create the fabric. To create the fabric, I will use this rectangle tool. Simply click on it to select, then click one on the page. And I will type in the width of 31.27 and press on the tab key. So the height by default, I have 50 centimeter, which is perfect. And then I'm going to click on OK. Next, I will click on the transform pattern tool and then click on the pattern and simply click and bring it down just a little bit. And after that, I will create two internal lines from the center. To do so, I will select this Edit Pattern tool, click on it, and then click one on this center line, right-click, and we want to select Offset as internal line. After that, by default, I have number of offset 2, which is perfect. If you're not, be sure to click on the arrow right there to increase or decrease. Then, Distant, Individual, Offset from, Selected line, perfect. Then, type in 8cm, press on the Tab key, and then type in this waist circumference here, 17.47. After that, I'm going to click on OK. Next, we want to create a three more internal line from the top. Simply click on it, right click, and then select offset as internal line. Then I'm going to click right here to add one more internal line, distant individual offset from selected line, perfect. And I'm going to change the line number one to 1.5, then press on the tab key here. And then line number two, I will change that to 12, and then press on the tab key once again, and line number three, I will change that to 16. Next, I'm going to click on OK. After that, we want to create another internal line from the bottom here. Simply click one, right click, select offset as internal line. Then I'm going to decrease that to one, and change that to 2.5. After that, I'm going to click on OK. Next, I want to draw the A-line skirt shape. Simply select the internal polygon slash line tool. Click one right here. Zoom it in a little bit. Click one right here. And then click one right here. After that, I will press return enter on the keyboard to finish the line. Okay, next, I'm going to create a point right here and right here. To do that, simply using these Transform Pattern Tool, click on it, and then click one on that line right there, right click, and I'm going to come over here to Extend Slash Trim Add Point to Pattern Outline. After that, come down here, and I want to create a curve here for the bottom line. Simply using this tool here, it's super cool, guy. Edit Curvature Tool, click on it to select, then I'm going to click one and then drag. After that, I'm going to cut this line out. To cut the line, I will use this transform pattern tool, click on it to select, and then click one right here on the line, right click, and I'm going to select cut. Next, I'm going to delete this piece right here because we don't need it anymore. Simply click right here to delete. Next, we want to convert all these lines to baseline. To do so, first we want to lock the pattern outline. Simply right click on the workspace, select lock all pattern outline. After that, I'm going to use this edit pattern tool my key selects all this line here right click and then select 
convert to baseline. Then we also want to lock these lines as well. Simply go to here, to the pattern lock, and then we want to select lock baseline. And now all the baseline are locked. I'm going to right click one on the page again and then unlock all pattern outlines. Next, I want to convert this point right here to a curve point. Simply click on the point and then convert to curve point. After that, we want to add a dot here. To add a dot, simply click on that point, right click, then select add dot. And we want the total width to be 2 cm and total length to be 10 cm. Then I'm going to click on OK. After that, I will press on return enter on the keyboard to finish the dot. Okay. Next, we want to draw a line here from here to here. To draw a line, I will use this internal polygon slash line tool. Click on it and then click on this point right here. And then come over here to this high point. This time, I will click on twice to end the line. And next, I'm going to create a curve here. Simply use this edit curvature tool. And click and then drag down here a little bit. Next, we want to cut this part out. To cut the part out, I will use this transform pattern tool. Click on that line, right click, and then select cut. Okay, now I'm going to remove this piece right here because we don't need them anymore. Next, we want to correct this dot length. Simply click one right here, and the length on this side is 8.84. And then I'm going to check on this side here, it will be 8.99. I'm going to use my calculation. So 8.99 subtract 8.84. So it's equal 0.15. I'm going to click on that dot there, drag it up, press on shift, right click, and I'm going to type in 0.15. And then I'm going to click on OK. So next I'm going to double check here. Simply click on that line. Now it is 8.99. And right here 8.99. That is perfect.